Hey, hey, if it ain't here, it ain't good. Thanks for watching, thanks for listening, thanks for like, subscribing. Welcome to the Hood Podcast. My name is Jay, as always, and joined as always, we got the homies. We got my boy Rayama. What's going on, sir? Uh, <laughs> unmute thyself. You know, I'm really getting pissed off on my microphone today. What the fuck is going on today with my microphone, bro? I, I just, I, I. We got the same microphone, man. I ain't gonna let you talk bad about the microphone. And we have the lovely Chris. How are you, Chris? I got mushroom problems this week. What what does that mean? I don't know whether you that's know, about the, the <laughs> show we're about to talk about or about what is the something I else. I truly hope it's about the show. I oh, are you talking about the mushroom cloud? Was that was that near you? Was, oh, was well, the mushroom cloud near you? Okay, so the mushroom problems apply to everything, apparently. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, I was. I'm a little. I was like, damn. Did she find some fungus on her electric toothbrush or something? Like I was what? Scared. Ew. You know, that, that gets sanitized every day. It's some too folks, specific. Some folks don't know. Some folks just don't know. You, they realize. Mm-hmm. Too late. They've been brushing their teeth with a big ass mushroom. For you like know what? Two I I do grow. I do have mushrooms all over my yard, like spring through fall. So I'm I'm You're sorry. Be the that could be a side. <laughs> that could be a side income if you know what to do with it. <laughs> well, it, it that's, means that's my not soil, advice. That's just a joke. <laughs> it means my soil is super healthy, but also if if mm. the, if the thing starts, I'm sorry, everybody. Spoiler alerts as always as we review the Last mm-hmm. of Us episode five. Mm-hmm. We on five? Man, I don't even know, bro. Yeah, it's five. Wait. Yeah, it's yeah, five. It's five. five. It's getting to the point where I just watch it and then I be sad and then it's- <laughs> <laughs> Well, I can tell you this much. I definitely remember this episode's name, Endure and Survive. Oh. As soon as I saw the name of, let me just, I'm going to just let y'all have it, but I'm going to say this. As soon as I saw the name of the episode, I was like, oh shit, I should have played the game up to this point. Yeah. Yeah. See, with the exception of Bill, they are still being very faithful to the original story beats. I mean, incredibly faithful. Hmm. So... Yeah. So, Jay, you called me and you asked me, did it go down like that? And I am going to say, absolutely, yes, it did. Put my business out there, though. I did call you, though. (laughs) Because after you watch this show, (laughs) this episode, no one would be mad at you if you had to call somebody. Yeah. Black yeah. History Month of all months. I know, right. bro. <laughs> this was not okay. I, this is what I. This is what I. I was secretly hoping. I was secretly hoping that it didn't go down like this. No, I didn't. <laughs> they said oh, we better be very loyal. <laughs> y'all want this? This is what they. Y'all asked for this. <laughs> 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 I, I thought they was gonna spare my little home. No, you no, cause you would have been like, uh, you know, they changed some things. I understand to keep it mainstream, but nope, one to one. Yeah, it's 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 it. That last scene, oh, they yeah, they stuck, they stuck the fucking landing. They stuck the fucking landing, boy. <laughs> so, um, I don't know if we're doing a scene by scene or what. Nah, nope. No. <laughs> All right. Well, they what they did change were a bunch of the shits that I just didn't care about, like old girl, the filler, Jason Henry. Uh, I mean, they do chase us. They do chase us in the game, like, but it's like a town full of motherfuckers with military vehicles 
and they want your shit. Like they want your shoes. So they uh, they will 50 cal your ass in the middle of the street to get it. And that's that's just basically what it is. So like that's that whole section. It's just you and them trying to get out because these motherfuckers are like super evil banditos or whatever. And it wasn't like some like self-righteous crusade to avenge a fallen brother. Yeah. Or anything like that. It oh yeah, like, you know they had like, to add that part. Nikes, homie. Give me them shits. Yeah. Uh, they had to add that part for you know dramatic effect. Yeah. yeah. I need to find my who <laughs> you killed my brother. Oh. We evil as fuck though, but you killed my brother. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what else did we think of this episode? It was bull hooey. Bull hooey. Bull hooey. They were supposed to live for like three more episodes at least. Chris, <laughs> this is why I was kicking myself like I should have played this part first <laughs> so I could be mentally and emotionally prepared. His exact words were, I would have liked any kind of heads up before that shit. <laughs> so oh, was, man. Oh, yeah. Hey. I made I, an actual I, note. <laughs> okay. I wrote under The Last of Us, we meet daughter, dead. Meet Tess, dead. Meet Bill and Frank, dead. Meet evil Karen, Henry, and Sam, dead, dead, dead. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of shit. They just no. gonna introduce us to people only to kill them every episode. This is it. I don't know this, what's what's to your point, about. Lady Shasha. <laughs> to your point, Lady Shasha. This is borderline anthology series, boy. <laughs> My name is Joel you, and yeah. Ellie. Oh, 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 oh! You missed one. You missed one. Who did I miss? Somebody else died. Who? Who was Joel's it? Joel's brother. Oh, he's still trying to get to him in, in Michigan. I, it didn't happen I, yet. But we so, met him. Thanks for telling us that he's going to die. Damn, nigga. <laughs> you see? This is what Last of Us... Last of us this is, is how Last of Us stands get down, right? They they relish in spoiling that shit. <laughs> what I'm saying is... I'm not spoiling that. What I'm saying is that we met Tommy and we do mm-hmm. not know if he is dead or not yet. Okay, now you yeah. see he walked that shit way back, boy. Because <laughs> the way you had, the way you said it with your chest the first time, <laughs> you right forgot right one. Right after, right after I'm just saying that might be. That. What I'm saying is that's that's the exception to the rule, right? <laughs> <now>. <laughs> okay. The exception to the rule, right now. Huh, R. R. P. Oh, to the brother, man. Thank you for letting us know. <laughs> Damn, know did any, wait, is anybody <laughs> that we met still alive? Man. Did Marlene make it? Fuck, did Marlene well, she make was ble- it? She was low-key bleeding out when they dipped, right? <laughs> so. Uh, yeah, well, maybe. Yeah, hell. But that would be kind of goofy to, like, ha- get the actual voice actress that was doing it. And then just first ever. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All right, have a good day. <laughs> what the fuck is this, Game of Thrones? No, but it is I HBO. on Marlene. <laughs> <laughs> I do like how that um, kid infected one got old girl though. Yeah, she uh, yeah. She does. That was, yeah. That might have been the creepiest part of the episode for me. He hopped in that back seat too. Remember he that she was active. She was, she was like a zombie making or something. She, she was scouting. <laughs> it's sniping. Yeah. What's going Something on? Something happened. Oh, I, oh, I, I was, was being, I, heard, I was being nosy. <laughs> I thought oh. I heard somebody talking. That I was listening. I don't know who it was, but I was listening. I was like, "What they talking about?" That shit What's sounded good. I was like, uh-huh, what else? <laughs> we was being real shady. I don't know All, right. What All right, back to back to back to minding our business. Okay. <laughs> I'm still annoyed that they like. They're here. It's like, oh yeah, you get to see them interact with some other people finally, like in a <laughs> decent way. Yeah. For what for where they are. And and then this episode happens. And it's like, oh, well, hope you had fun with those two minutes. It's yeah. Yeah. It's a wrap. Well, I mean, it's a zombie. It's they a, are a zombie I will world. say, man, one thing these well besides the obvious two main characters, uh, Joel Ellie. Ain't nobody got no plot armor, man. 
Yeah, yeah, they are indiscriminate. <laughs> Even if yeah. you survive, you're going to get shot in the foot or something. like. <laughs> they, are, they are indiscriminate. Taking now, collateral it was, it was damage. Time, it was times in the game where I was like, damn, black folks just be catching hell in this game. <laughs> but but it, now that I look back on it, shit, it's everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Equal opportunity, bro. <laughs> shit, not even Bill made it, bro. <laughs> yeah, Bill's out of there. He made it in the game. Yeah, I did. I did meet up with him in the game. He was that's, supposed to survive in the game. So. That's why I turned it off. I was like, "Eh, you, you dead though. I'm out of here." Dead. <laughs> yeah, it's like I can't. Get, that's that's right where I stopped. Yeah, you stopped there and you didn't play any further, and that, and and in the end, you kind of played yourself. Yeah, because I knew so, I know how y'all fans do. Y'all like to spoil last of us as soon as humanly possible. <laughs> As soon as y'all even see the preview for the next episode, you'll be like, okay, this is what's about to happen. And these are the people who are about to die <laughs> in alphabetical and chronological order. Oh. <laughs> what did you find the trans character? <laughs> oh, well. What What did y'all think about the bloater? Is that what they look well, like in know, the game? Yes. Yeah, they, they quite swole. Yeah, like, they be looking like that, and they just and they be throwing big ass mushrooms at you that yeah. like explode into spores mm. and choke you to death. I feel like that's not what it what it was doing. Nah, he was <laughs> no, he, he got a, he got a buff. Pretty, he got a buff. It was pretty. It was pretty much Hulk smashing, and then he then he turned into Juggernaut. When I thought of, when <laughs> that's, I thought that's, when, that's my frame of reference. <laughs> when I heard yeah. when I heard uh bloater, I thought. I, I did not expect Buddy to hop out shirtless with the six pack and the Hulk <laughs> and the Hulk shorts ripped up like abs yeah, all the way up, more, bruh. I thought he's gonna look more bloated. Nah, yeah. man, he's <laughs> yeah, he swole it. He swole. Yeah. Got bloaters, bloaters got so many goddamn gains. Yeah, just so much gains. Yeah. So I like yeah. I like that contortionist kid that did, that, that was in, was the, in the back of the car. Ellie. Oh my yeah. god! Well, how about that scene? That was creepy. Whoever Shout out to her, that, whoever that little actress right? was. Whoever <laughs> played that is uh is a they get a lot of little dancers to play shit mm -hmm. like this, and that's yeah. That mm -hmm. They did that in um. I bet you. I bet you she from they, Lovecraft. Either that or um Maybe. Insidious. Yeah. What was what was it? Insidious? No, not Insidious. It was one of the Conjuring movies. The devil made me do it. Yeah, where the little boy was on the table and did a, ba a hell of a fight back bend until his head was under his ass. I don't know what. I don't know how. It, yeah. Oof. A contortionist. That's what they. Yeah. they I think look, when I was doing this shit as a kid, they wasn't looking for me. They should have put me. <laughs> I can't. I can't do it no more. Don't ask mm -hmm. me to. <laughs> You're one of those kids that can put your feet behind your head, huh? I was a skinny little some some bitch, so you know. Yeah, I... Just answer the question: Was you putting your feet <laughs> behind your I, head? Not, remove I, the I, remove I the, the remove the adult kind of answer the question. A kid. I can neither. I can neither. We're talking neither, about kid stuff. I can neither. Uh, See how America got us messed up. We can't even talk not, about no. innocent <laughs> children shit. No, this is a like, adult. <laughs> This is a pure, this is a pure Roy thing because he says so much weird stuff. <laughs> <laughs> you know that he be having punchlines, he be having to wait for it. All right, all right, all right. Okay, all right, he did. He cried wolf right, too right, many right, times. Me, you get no on, sympathy. Me, he did know me, all the porn abbreviations that I did not me, know. Let me push past. Let me push past the toxic masculinity real quick to give you. A <laughs> Thank you. Ew. All right. Hell yeah! Well, I put my yeah. legs behind my head, shooting that shit up. Boy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my my sister could do that. I was never that flexible. I could never I could never do it. <laughs> I'm talking about we were little kids. We seven eight years old. You bendy flexy like that. <laughs> I was like thirteen. Oh shit! <laughs> so you do this to yourself, Ria? <laughs> you do this to yourself. <laughs> Yeah. Every time, every show, it's <laughs> <is> coming. <laughs> All right, in the next. <laughs> <laughs> you
you broke Jay. Congratulations. But then I turned 25, and let me tell you something about 25. <laughs> Your body just don't fucking care no more. It just be like, uh. Bro, at the ten, at the age of 24, what were you doing? <laughs> At 25, man, you know, sometimes you just sit there, you you 25 years old, it's 10 years later than when you was a kid, and you just be like, damn, can I still, do I still got it? Can I still do the shit? Can I still do the yoga shit? All that shit? No, you can't. You can't, yeah. bro. <laughs> Matter of fact, I, if you I trip and fall, if you trip fall on the sidewalk after 22, you, you might, you have yes. a really high chance of dying. One of my cousins tried to do his standing backflip and almost wound up on his face. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, don't, don't do that shit after 25. Stop I it. A, I got a song for you guys about that. I'm going to put it in the <laughs> chat. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, it's, it's, I, I really enjoyed this episode. Even like mm -hmm. with the stuff that they did change, it wasn't, that's what. That's I don't know who is in the writing room making these decisions for them. Like we can change this because it just won't affect shit. Mm -hmm. Um, but whoever that motherfucker is, they are doing a great job. Promote that, guy. promote mm -hmm. that person. Whoever that person is, look, let that motherfucker go somewhere and play every other. Video. Let him go play God of War. Let him go play <laughs> Halo, and I mean, give him a bunch honestly, of paper. Honestly, it's probably a game dev in there saying that shit. Hey, bro. Oh, it. I am. Yeah. I would not be surprised. And guess what? That's it could change if it, it comes out. It could be. It could. It could be game changing. No pun intended. I mean, you know. You gonna have these. You gonna have get. Motherfuckers gonna be like, damn, who, who, who wrote the original Halo? Because we really need them motherfuckers. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I wish that show. Yeah. And arrest the people who have created this monstrosity. I want them. Behind bars. <laughs> Y'all think I'm playing. Oh, the, the folks that did Resident Evil, a public execution. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They should be powers. banned, banned Lance, from television production altogether. Lance, they be Lance is cool, somewhere. though. I want to say Lance <laughs> is cool. They were a Lance. good actor. If it wasn't for that actor, that would not have worked. That's, anybody's life. He carried... He carried me to the end. To the, he carried my broken soul to the finish line. Because if he wasn't in it, I wasn't finishing it. No way. Yeah. That's the good thing about video game adaptations, though, is that like you can't. A lot of the developers and people who wrote for that those games are still alive. Mm -hmm. you know, Chilling. The that's why I think that like. Novel adaptations just have no fucking hope. And keep in I mean, mind, if somebody fuck up a novel yeah. adaptation and the author did, it's over. Well, here, mm -hmm. here's the other part to this. I don't know if you know, you probably know this from me, a PS, PS5 fanboy. But yeah. what <laughs> <clears throat> you know, they're coming out with the whole like remake, right? Like this year. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. not only were the writers and the developers available, but they was really active. Like this shit was it like was fresh on their memory. Yeah, they like, man, hey, somebody came in and was like, "Hey man, we trying to make a, a show about the Last of Us." Can they be like, the they probably was like, "Oh, nigga, we are actively developing the Last of Us." So we we just help, we just so had, just in case somebody would have came at us with some HBO size money, we already had a script. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, crack that bad boy open. Oh, yeah. and we're gonna need Pedro Pascal. <laughs> we, do. we have a very specific thing we got going on. Um, what else do we want to so they were underground in the game too, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. They spent a lot more time underground in the game. Matter of okay. fact, there's a whole like B story in the game yeah. where you like remember how I was telling y'all where it's like they they have all these notes that tell all these stories and shit. <sighs> yeah, yes. I'm gonna start, man. When I start playing again, I'm not reading person. nothing else, man. What else? What else could they possibly show me? Oh, I'm man. running it past so every note. You, like, you find the first note, and it's just like I find, I made it underground. All them folks that was up above, <laughs> they stupid. And I'm not letting them in either. I done built a nice little fort up in here. I'm gonna be a mole man. Oh, actually, I met this lady. She had three kids with her. <laughs> <laughs> was like, is she real cute. I might actually bring her back in here. Then, like, you get into this one part, and you just like, man, 
She on the other side of the door. I'm in here with the kids. We locked up. That is that story. Oh, I, must, I might have said something about that story last week. Yeah, that you is did this mention section. it. That oh, is this wow. section. Where it's like somebody got infected in the little compound and then everybody got their ass ate the fuck up. And that's probably what they showed us with the, the little daycare center that they were sitting on. That was probably mm-hmm. the compound from the game mm-hmm. or no? Yeah, maybe. Possibly. Probably. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because because they came from underground. Mm-hmm. So um in that in that one you had to like make your way through it. They got he he started out by himself and then he started like just gathering people. Like cause he got he got too lonely. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Oh, I've been here for so long. It's been five years. And I, I just want people. I need somebody to touch or whatever. Whatever the fuck he was saying. And mm-hmm. then <laughs> <laughs> and then you just had people. You had people, kids, they had like yeah. laundry rooms and bathrooms, and that shit was crazy. So for the in the game, they like were discarding kids left and right, weren't they? Cause that the lady she thought like any section in the TV show where you'd see like evidence of children the kids are dead or there's like a little spot where they were able to survive for half a second a lot of the kids get uh in the game the kids usually get shuffled off to like some sort of federal orphanage okay and pressed into like military uh service so I mean that's just what happened, and that's a that's such a just a dumbass system. Because honestly, if all your children are just going directly into the army, who the fuck is doing like non army shit? Like we need, yeah, we like need, doctors and people to grow food. And they're gonna have up. to open a couple more branches. There's an agriculture branch in the military, <laughs> Federal. <laughs> Is that what there is? When somebody say the agriculture branch, they get jumped immediately. Oh. <laughs> nah, I wouldn't be jumping no agriculture branch. If you if a nigga if a nigga bend down and stand up and, and toss watermelons all fucking day long, <laughs> I am not getting in a fist fight with him. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh they they day. actually they actually proved that on um, Tripping, physical, physical one hundred. Y'all seen this show called Physical One Hundred? No, what happened? It's on oh, Netflix, uh, Netflix with the uh, Korean yeah. with the oh yeah yeah, yeah. Well, it's, oh my god oh man you're this, really this you're dude, really strong <laughs> I'm feeling dude, on your chest this dude that was fire and rescue beat hella like it's a hundred people in the yeah, contest he's whooping the two groups, fifty and fifty the fire and rescue dude beat like a hundred fucking athletes <laughs> and gymnasts <laughs> like gymnast, like how like it, national it, team it was a match that you had to like hold on to like. You had to just hang there, yeah. And the gymnast up yeah. there, like, oh man, I'm I can do this in my sleep. I'm just hanging he up. He got here. beat by the army dude. Army, yeah. It was the army dude and the fireman was beating all these trained athletes. <laughs> all they do is is, is be athletic. <laughs> it was great to see. That's funny. And they had one dude there that um he does like the zombie chore- choreography for a lot of the Korean shows. He was really good. Yep. He was fast. All I know is I know a total of two people who have grown up on a on a watermelon farm, and them niggas are basically white Samoans. <laughs> they are like huge and mm-hmm. strong for no reason. And well, I know the reason they chucking melons all day. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so they, they strong as fuck. They just uh that shit is inhuman. I said, God damn, but these farm boys be out here just swole. Just mm-hmm. roll effortlessly. So, hey. You want to stay fit? Go get you a watermelon farm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, that's got dual purpose because, like, you're strong. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You're doing the food. Also, if you need defense, they can defend the food they're growing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's one of the best fruits you could ever eat is watermelon. It has a lot of, a lot of nutritional value, actually. Bro, just imagine who who would attack a watermelon farm. What the fuck is your purpose? What are you a trying to bag? accomplish? Mm-hmm. What are you trying to accomplish? What are you going to get out of this? You going you can carry a maximum of two to three watermelons away. You are not. Wait, <laughs> I just thought of a physical matchup for the watermelon against the watermelon farmers. Pumpkin farmers. Oh, well. <laughs> they can take the, they, I bet you the pumpkin farmers can take the watermelon farmers. <laughs> <That was my laughs> or at least it'll be a fair match. 
Gourds versus melons. Yes. Why do we grow so many goddamn pumpkins? What the fuck is what the fuck are people using for? I see pumpkins all year round. What the fuck are people <laughs> using these for? Yeah, because you, people... you can't have pumpkin pie, and I don't know any other food to make with pumpkins. <laughs> pumpkin pie is trash, though. I like anyway, it. It's all right. Way the fuck off. Yeah, sorry, my bad. I did it again. I I take responsibility. <laughs> we are way the fuck off track. <laughs> Jay is just oh, looking man. down like God damn Shasha. Hey, look, you on you Twitter go right get you now. some Adderall. <laughs> no, you good. No, it's fine. Oh, hey, this is Hood Podcasting, and yeah. people should expect this by now. I'm tripping. Yeah, where 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 are we in the show? Oh, okay. And then after the and after the big ass zombie attack. Oh, by the way, that part Jay, where it's like you have to like save them from getting run over by the truck and shit. You sniping? Uh, yeah, yeah. Same I'm thing. I'm pretty sure that's still in there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's still in there. Uh, uh that I can't wait to play that part because he was. Yeah. Um, uh, Joe was busting. Yeah, Joe. Joe was knocking them, <laughs> knocking them down, boy. One shot, one kill. He, he it's like he just we got a little rusty at first. He was like, yeah. oh, okay, got it. <laughs> I was kind of mad he didn't shoot Evil Karen in the face. Like, why mm-hmm. would? Why didn't he shoot he, her? Yeah, so many times. Oh, you know they were, saving, so it. Many they were shots. saving it so that kid could get her. Yeah. yeah. He took so many shots that could have been her. Mm-hmm. Like, there were so many shots he took that should have been her. And I and I was just like, you shooting zombies? Like, you shooting zombies while, while Ellie is, like, already stabbing them? Mm-hmm. You don't need to do that. <laughs> like, you can, you can stop doing that. Um, but then I was just like, well, it's... They're staying pretty, you know, good. They're, they're following mm-hmm. the story real well at this point still. Mm-hmm. And then they had that. And then there's the scene where uh, they're, like, sleeping in a little house. Like a little commandeered house. Mm-hmm. That's a nice little scene. Cute little scene between Ellie and Sam. By the mm-hmm. way, in the game, Sam is not deaf. Oh. He, he is, and he is very... What? Yeah, Sam is not. Sam is not deaf in the game. They they met. I assume they made him deaf in the show. Because what's worse than a little black kid getting uh, turned into a zombie? A little deaf black kid getting turned into a zombie. Oh, don't forget! Don't forget he uh, also had cancer. He had cancer. Oh yeah, he sold it. They they <laughs> hold the shit out of him. <laughs> So, I could have let him live. Right. They know he, he, he has to it, be. He wasn't gonna make it either way. He has to be historically accurate, so he has to be terminal. Sorry, there's nothing we can do. They said we had to pull every heartstring that's available. <laughs> Y'all lucky we didn't have him dead in a flashback like how we did Bill. Mm-hmm. He said some crazy. He said some uh, some funny shit in the uh, in the game too. She, Ellie was like, oh, he was like, Ellie, how old are you, yeah. Ellie? Ellie was like, I'm 14. He said, she said, how old are you? He said, uh, same. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, Shit. yeah. That's great. So, I, it was some good, I mean, it was some good banter between them two. So, you know. um, he was sniping. So, shout out to him. And then, like, the little gymnast zombie girl who did mm-hmm. the, uh, the leap of faith on the old girl's mm-hmm. face. Uh, face. Yep. And she started was ripping the I shit out it. of her. <laughs> yep. She did that. She did that. Uh, Planet of the Apes. Uh, leap. She beat. Did the shit you see out how many her. hits she got in in less than a second? Yes. <laughs> yeah. She deserved it though, especially all the trash she was talking. Did she want? Yeah, to she was killing her? like tons of people. So mm-hmm. you know, no love lost, but still, like she was getting she her ass whooped. The thing she hated. That's a, that's another thing. Like, why would you? That I guess hurt people hurt people, huh? You you like take down the fascist regime to become the fascist regime? Mm-hmm. Well, but, okay, but wasn't her brother on, like a real good life. person though? Yeah, you think that she would learn from his example, right? Uh, and she decided to become that. Like and that's what she became. Yeah. Yep. This does not go together. Mm-hmm. Well, fortunately, you don't have to worry about her storyline <laughs> much further. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then let's just get to the, I guess, 
I don't even know if you call this a cliffhanger, but the last scene. It was a resolution, bro. It was yeah. a resolution for what it was. It was no cliffhanger this time. Yeah. That, the, um, they ended reversed positions than they did last episode. How so? Uh, the up, Joel and Ellie was laid down. Oh yeah, yeah. Damn, bro. Why you say? Why you have to say? Like I mean, I just be noticing goofy shit, bro. Yeah. So Ellie and uh, little Sam are sitting up late, yeah. reading comic books, and then they're having a little conversation. And Sam turns to Ellie and he's like, "If you turn into a monster, are you still the same inside?" That shit broke my heart. And she was like, what happened? And he showed her the bite on his leg. Then she said, damn. I could probably give you some of my blood. She showed him hers. Her little thing. So I, my blood has medicine in it. I could probably. Oh, I was rooting for it. Fix too. you. I was rooting for you. I thought it was that simple. And how many of y'all thought that shit was going to work? Me. <laughs> I, 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 had, I, had a, I had a moment where Please. I thought maybe it would slow it down and then it would. Uh, he please. Really end up, you know. Absolutely not. That shit mm-hmm. absolutely didn't work. He asked Ellie, he said, will you stay up with me? She yeah. said, yeah, I promise. <laughs> I got you. Then she fell asleep. And when she woke up, he was sitting on the edge of the bed with his back turned. Cooling. Staring out the window. Boss mode. Sunrise Final boss him. mode. She said, Sam, you okay? He just turned around and went, ah! <laughs> I don't know the sound he made. It was a it was a scary. That was close sound. enough. It was cool. It was weird. You got the point so they, across. They done bust through the door and they fighting on the floor. And Joel and Henry are sitting there looking at them like, God damn, what is they doing? And they realize that Sam is infected. And Joel get up and he's like, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna come help you, Ellie, or however he say shit like that. And then and then Sam, uh, Henry said, Nope. Got you with the. I don't know if y'all can see it. My green, the gun. Mm-hmm. He said, "Nope, Mm-mm, you don't go." And and Joel didn't go. Joel said, "Well, Ellie, you're just gonna have to fight this fight on your own." Yeah. <laughs> you got this. Uh, after a little contemplation, Henry turns his gun on his little brother. Boom! Headshot. One, one shot, one kill. Very accurate for someone who's never been violent before. Oh my God. Um, so Sam got clapped. Mm. That was the end of Sam. And he was just dead on the floor. Hemorrhaging. Real sad. Um, let's rate this episode, shall we? <laughs> <laughs> Who wants to go first? Ten out of ten, nigga. No, no. This is amazing. You know, Chris, you don't understand how this works. You want to go first. <laughs> the first word you blurt out should not be your score, bro. <laughs> Knowledge let you go first. <laughs> A ten out of ten from the great Rayama. <laughs> why? Why do you? Why do you give it a ten? They made me feel, and I knew the shit was coming. Damn. It still made me feel. So I gotta get all oh, my crying out it the way. It didn't even end there. It didn't even end there. After Sam is dead on the ground, yeah. Henry looks around and then turns the gun on himself. Boom, it's over. So that's Henry and Sam gone. Exactly how it happened in the game. Oh god. It I don't want to play that part. Abrupt. Okay, I gotta play. Okay, so now I have to play the game now because I'm not gonna want to play it now. I don't want to play that part. <laughs> so now I have to. I need to just go on and beat the game. Damn it! You gonna have, you gonna have to do something. I'm so far behind. I'm like two episodes <laughs> behind. It's like that's like four hours. You good? So, Chris, what say you? I'm gonna give it a six. For the same reason, Holy I'm not. I'm shit. trying not to feel this way. What the heck is wrong with y'all? You Don't be introducing people, and then everybody's committing. You, you gotta mm-hmm. stop watching before you go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> it will have you say it. I'm over it. Stupid mushroom problems. A 
six out of ten from the lovely Chris. <laughs> Lady Shasha. I'm with Chris on this. Six out of ten also. Because oh. I want to I want to keep getting in, uh, in like introduced to people that are just gonna <laughs> die. Now I'm no longer gonna be invested in any character because I'm gonna be like, oh, well, you about to die. So why should I care about you? Unless they <laughs> I'm not like, even gonna be invested. <laughs> Unless they total assholes, then they get a couple episodes. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, they meet a dog next, and the dog survives. So. Oh, I was gonna say, oh, Shakira well. will be all up I'm here. Lying. That shit is a lie. I, believe that shit. I was about, I was about to say, I was about to put on my kufi and tell you, of course, the dog survived, but the black people don't survive. <laughs> I'm gonna put on my my kufi. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was an absolute lie. <laughs> so a six out of ten from the lovely lady Shasha. I, I had to give it a 10 out of 10, reluctantly. They was trying to... all my expectations. I, I'm not even going to I haven't felt like that since watching Wakanda Forever uh, Funeral. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just be out here with tears in my eyes watching everything. So, uh, yeah, shut up. Good episode. Well done. Last one. Hi, I foretold of this. Everybody was worried about that last episode. I said, just hold on, because uh, <laughs> here's two characters who look really important. And oh, it's a kid, so it's going to be a tear jerker. Now, the last episode feels like filler for real. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> no, it does. Yeah. Shout out. They, they had all this drama they made up. Well, do we have do we have any predictions besides from Mariama of next episode? We're gonna meet somebody else and they're gonna die. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, hey, hey, how you doing? My and this is my name's Jim. This is my what? Oh, oh, and this oh, is my, my and this is my pug. I call I, him Tony. I got a I got a plot twist. Her brother okay. isn't dead. He's actually alive now, and he survived, and all that went down for nothing. Mm. Oh, and I'm. Oh, and I'm blind too. Don't worry though. I, I'll be all right. Somehow I survived up to this point. I'll be just fine. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I, I forgot think... the old guy's name too. The old guy that let the the little boys up into the attic. He never came back neither. Oh yeah, he peaced out. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they caught his ass and tortured mm-hmm. him. Yeah, yeah they oh, got. Oh yeah, him. that was the doctor, wasn't it? Mm-hmm. Or was that the doctor, or was that someone else? I oh. think it was the doctor. It was the doctor? Okay. Because they did rewind all the way back to the Joel truck crash, right? Mm-hmm. So they were like going through. So he wouldn't have been locked up yet at that point, I guess. Oh, but they, they, they got they his had, ass immediately, they, though. <laughs> the craziest shit about this is they had just taken over 10 days ago. Yeah. And now there's a major zombie infection and no military person. <laughs> so, 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 so. Have them underground <laughs> chilling. Until... Yeah. So. I don't know if live gunfire and explosives is what I want to have if they all underground. Right. <laughs> We'd be like a quiet place part three. All right. Is it time for some hood news? Well, mm-hmm. first yep. of all, a very happy Valentine's Day to everybody from the Hood Podcast to you and yours. Mm-hmm. Smash responsibly. <laughs> Wash your booty first, though. I mean, smash responsibly if irresponsibility is not what you're going for. If you're just trying to listen, if you're going for a pregnancy this this week, don't go listen here. to stop everyone. Don't take <laughs> <your> <laughs> <fucking> <laughs> place in no place. Play him off. <laughs> We had to play you off like Sandman. Yeah. <laughs> Get us some Scorpios, you feel? Y'all Scorpios are wild. <laughs> and, and and I under I completely understood Chris Virgo motion of, of wash your ass first. That is so weird. I'm not a Scorpio, so I just oh, know that. Would you, I just, Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I, I know some Scorpios, they're wild. <laughs> and and Gemini's, they wild too. I, Who knew? Yeah. 
I've got a list of 37 bizarre Valentine's Day gifts that will woo the weirdo in your life. Wait, let me get my slideshow ready. I'm so excited. <laughs> okay. Woo the weirdo. <laughs> yeah, you. Like that sound already. It's, it's specifically for you. <laughs> terrible. Yeah, Roy's okay. Gonna, Roy's going to own 35 things on this list, probably. <laughs> Are you ready yet? Yeah, mm -hmm. go for it. Oh, okay. So the first one is a bouquet of roses sandwich board. Oh, do you not have the picture up? Yeah, I'm looking at it. Uh... Oh. That just sounds <laughs> terrible. <laughs> well, this one's just like silly. It's like a Halloween costume. If you don't want to buy flowers, you could do that. Okay, the second one is underwear with QR code that links to a sexy <laughs> playlist. Oh. oh. Like a, wait, like, okay. What is the nature of this playlist? Oh, man. Music, videos, what are we talking about? It says a sexy playlist. It doesn't say it has to be music. Please don't hate them. Wait, if we get down to our underwears, you stop to scan a scan QR yeah. code. I'm going to be so bad. <laughs> take a pic real quick. Wait, it's loading. My Wi-Fi is so slow. <laughs> <laughs> My Wi Fi is so slow. I'm yeah. sorry. Let me cast it to the TV real quick. Oh, oh, <laughs> is your wait, TV, living room TV or bedroom TV? I don't know mm -hmm. where we're taking this oh, right now. Yeah, I get it. Don't cast well, it to the room TV. Playing, <laughs> at the neighbor's house. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, hun, um, you got your phone on you? <laughs> Some hardcore okay. fucking porno on the screen. <laughs> Next up is a Titanic door raft. It's an inflatable pool raft shaped like the Titanic door. Because reasons, I guess. Yeah. That's not romantic at all. <laughs> there, was, the there was room for Rose to let whatever his name was up on the door with her, and That's she didn't. Look, That's the option. She did him dirty. Uh, she she let him... <laughs> There, I can't remember his name. There was, <laughs> the science said there's no possible way that there wasn't room. Yeah. <laughs> that big ass <laughs> sailboat well, ass door. This mm -hmm. inflatable raft is big enough for two people too, but there is only a chick on it and the dude's yeah, like hanging he's, off the he's side. Done, he's dirty. <laughs> I would trust that the raft before I would trust two people on that little bubbly ass float. Mm -hmm. Okay, next up we have a naughty Cupid costume. For the dude in your life. It's okay, I'm glad I didn't share underwear. my screen. <laughs> it's red underwear with suspenders and gold wings. And this dude looks very bored wearing it. Can can I, should I show this? No. Are you sure? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So after that, we have a combination of razor and vibrator. And this one, I was like, oh. Uh, that doesn't sound like a good idea. Right. That's you don't like two things that don't match. You don't <laughs> want to get confused early in the morning. Right. Mm -hmm. The top of the razor part pops off and then I guess the <laughs> back end of it is a vibrator. But yeah. I don't know about that one. There will be some ER trips off of that one. <laughs> it probably already has been. Oh yeah. Yeah. Next up is a Lexi Luna sex doll. I can, I can show this one. This Remember when we tried one. to get sponsored? Okay. Oh. It kind of reminds me of Elvira. Yeah, a little bit. Her neck mm -hmm. kind of swole. <laughs> <laughs> well, it, it has to be because you got to imagine the stuff that goes on with the head. You can't have a weak neck because it'll just pop off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> Right, what else we got? Scientifically, everyone. I might need an example of this neck activity. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just... you you know all the Pornhub terms. Don't no, tell me. Like... <laughs> yeah, she, I, she I remembers. She got receipts on you. She pulled about. receipts on you. <laughs> first of all, my, I am I'm a virgin, first of all. <laughs> I think your daughter would disagree. My daughter <laughs> would disagree. <laughs> I hope you're not, for your sake. <laughs> you know... You are I, not I am the father. As the driven snow. <laughs> oh okay, let's get back to the list because I'm starting to see some decent stuff on here. <laughs> oh, Jesus. 
Okay, the next one. <laughs> Not this one, though. <laughs> I'm sorry. Give me a second. It is a come face dual pump action penis game. <laughs> <laughs> so there are two ladies situated in front of these things. Gawk the game. <laughs> clock stances and I guess you shake it until it it's like that like high a, face smash game it's I like, guess. It's like a shake weight with extra like extra <laughs> benefits? I, I don't know what. Yeah, Are we still talking about the apparatus with a razor on it? <laughs> no, no, no. no. Further down. Okay. If okay. only. <laughs> Where is this list at? Let me take a look at these. What I the fuck it. is going on? Oh yeah, y'all gotta yeah. pull up. Dude, we can't pull this up on YouTube. We can uh, <laughs> You can pull up the list because, on your own. Because this personal was the device. Item, this was the item that I, that were I definitely need visual representation. Okay, okay I'm glad you. I'm glad you. <laughs> it's it's the pink and purple item right underneath the sex doll lady. Yes. Picture. It is double sided. This should look like a uh, like a like a family board game or some shit. Like, you know how they have no, all the, no, it, how they, it, it really don't. I, I don't know what I, what kind of games you've been playing, sir. <laughs> this don't like, answer that. This should look like y'all 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 know there's there's a game out there where it's just a donkey, and you put like little equipment on it, and if you and it and if you like do it the wrong way, the donkey kick off all the shit. That's what this reminds me of. Like, they, they uh, just, like, around. Uh, uh, this don't <laughs> remind me of a donkey kicking shit just, over his back. They gotta, get, they gotta get close and then do a little yaga yaga. This reminds me of something else. Put him in the face. Okay. That's that, that's, okay, next item. She the is penis. really in Wait. God damn. Wait, wait, why are you moving too fast? <laughs> <laughs> I, I think we're done with this one. Okay, go ahead. Okay, a penis shaped charcuterie board. So this has. Okay. Um, so if your penis looks like this, get help. Yeah, that's I mean, true. Obviously. That's true. Yeah. Get but if help. The tip but if is you so have hairy. A penis like this on your dining room table and you're sharing it with friends, it's mm, okay. That looks like a warty penis tip to me, sir. <laughs> uh, I would, I would direct you to the nearest uh, hospital because you need emergency <laughs> assistance yeah okay this next one up is super tame it's a this buds for you gift set and minus the bud wise like if we could like switch that out for another <laughs> beer oh exquisite <laughs> so i've heard i've this never had kinda, alcohol before this is kind of stupid though you could just go buy yeah, a picture and some it's buds just flowers and beer. beer that shit is right but then you get like the brand budweiser vase that you can obviously repurpose down the line so i so it, I, i'll give them the slight nod for that because you know that's whole ass picture right there okay next up we have a porn film script autographed by adult star siri oh. doll okay I don't want no script autograph by porn star. I've never heard of. I, I do want to know. The, I do want to read the script though because uh, that's too many pa sheets of paper. <laughs> <laughs> Are these multiple scripts? Yeah. <laughs> because yeah. that big ass paragraph in the middle right there will completely and utterly suffice. It sounds like it sounds. It looks like she <clears throat> performs in more elaborate parody types. You feel me? Oh, yeah. So that's what it looked. I'm just looking at the script. <laughs> looking at. You look familiar, big dog. Are you zooming? Are you zooming in and reading too? Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> I don't like, oh yeah, I know I that. The that's resolution the, is high enough. That's the spoof one they did. Is this the Pirates of the Caribbean? No, I don't know. I, I don't know. Okay, next up we have underwear that shows teddy bears humping. Uh, it's like the it's like the hint I draws, but like <laughs> not it. Not as yeah, it's just not as good. Just so good. yeah. So next up, we have another sexy cupid costume. This is the ladies' version this time in pink and white. Where are they finding costumes in February? What the fuck is happening here? You can get they're available all year online. round. Yeah, <clears throat> the internet keeps you supplied up all year round now. <sighs> Okay, next up we have cream filled beaver. <laughs> Jesus, that's the name of that. <laughs> <laughs> I come 
had light and dark chocolate, apparently. Oh, God. <laughs> and they're filled with rum truffle and champagne cream. So, I want your, I want to come, Beaver. Anybody? <laughs> Anybody want, no, uh, don't, uh, don't say those words. <laughs> Please. <laughs> okay, oh, so, oh, cream filled clam. That's the next one on the list, right? Oh, Let me shoot. See. Why didn't they, No, that isn't. It's a love, oh. a vibrating love hammer. And it's a pink vibrator that looks like a hammer. Because, I guess. This is a claw hammer. They, by the way. they, put, they took out the know. ER and they added the A. Oh. <laughs> 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 on the hammer. It is now a hammer. I don't know if they wow. just spelled it normally with somebody <laughs> sued him who owns yeah. the word hammer. <laughs> MC Hammer. I'm I'm gonna clean up this the name of this next food item because. No, say it with your, <laughs> say it with your chest. How about I just say it? I say it. I got you, man. Please don't. <laughs> These are <laughs> pussy pops. <laughs> he just don't be caring. Like it's not his <laughs> channel, so he can give a fuck. <laughs> So this is this is held by a lady that's licking on a vagina lollipop, and mm -hmm. she's wearing a big vagina that looks like well, a technically, tongue. not a vagina. It's a clitoris. Oh, yeah, the yeah. <laughs> uh, the outer. Let's well, got some. Check Sasha. Vulva. Is there a little? Is there a little bit of a vulva? Yeah. You know what? You're right. When you zoom in, it yeah, is the whole vulva. Yes. It's got yeah. yeah. <laughs> After further here. deliberation, yeah. <laughs> the, one on her head, though, the thing on her head looks like a toilet seat, though. Like a yeah, it's sort of like a fucked up bagel. I don't yeah. know. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird. Oh god. Okay, so uh, next up we have a snore reducing pillow. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Which you know that's practical. For <laughs> Basically, just sit your ass time. up. <laughs> <laughs> Do not lie on your back ever again. Mm -hmm. Hey, that might be comfortable for Stick your head TV. in this slot. Yeah, like I was that. thinking that. Like, watching TV in bed, that might actually be practical. You don't feel like that's you got a sleep paralysis on. demon on you. <laughs> <laughs> you got your in the like, no, I've never, <laughs> in my life, if somebody buys me a pillow that puts me in a full nest, I'm going to be mad as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be mad as fuck, <laughs> <laughs> okay, so next up we have singled, married, and divorced wines, because uh, yeah, okay. Hey, you know what? This this is reminding me of that episode of not episode. It was some black wedding type. Uh, no, 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 brown sugar. That movie Brown Sugar. We was like, we're out here celebrating, celebrating my divorce. Y'all remember that scene? <laughs> No I don't think I saw that movie. I don't remember that old ass scene from that old ass good ass movie. That's a good ass movie, homie. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. If you ain't seen it's Brown Sugar, go, go the see best, it. It's good. Okay. The best soundtrack. I, I suggest you all use VPNs first because Roy suggested this. Oh, yeah. Okay, oh. so this next up we have <laughs> what we got? a wine bottle that looks suspiciously like a sex organ. Mm -hmm. This is just a giant. Penis that I'm what? You skip what? Wait, no, 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 no. no. Okay. She said the, no. the the single married divorce wine. Yeah, oh, here said that one. Yeah, and then My you bad. can put that into this next one. That was kind of a mid one right there. Like that was a bad idea. So let's go yeah. to the next one. This is just a this is just a a dick with alcohol in it. Give me the coochie <laughs> yeah. pop. Mm -hmm. I don't. Okay, maybe maybe I'll be into this next one then. Oh, yeah. It is a gold plated prostate massager. It <laughs> cost <laughs> it cost twenty five hundred dollars. And it's like I got attachments. <laughs> I, I, I'd be mad if you just didn't give the twenty five hundred dollars. No, <laughs> this is for people who money is not an issue and never uh, has mm -hmm. been and never will be. It's gold plated too. It's not even mm -hmm. like. Damn. I won't go somewhere else, but where? <laughs> <laughs> the only place you haven't put it yet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. Okay, so next up we have a fleece blanket of X Men making out. Okay, that shit hard as fuck though. It do look raw. I ain't gonna lie, this shit. Oh no, man. The, this the this the nineties gambit with yeah, the nineties. Yes. Mm -hmm. The power couple. Yeah. Not the nineties show. The nineties comic. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm smashing if I get that. Okay, what the hell is what this next? in the world? Okay, <laughs> <laughs> well, that escalated yeah, quickly. Oh, we yeah. have a grenade-shaped male vibrator. And this, yeah, put it around your your junk apparently, and it looks like a grenade because someone has a fetish for this, probably. Well, listen, y'all. Some people, uh, this is this this just ain't for everybody. You know, what I'm oh, saying you need a decent oh. amount of meat. This, to make this, use of this product. If you don't this, have a decent amount of meat, you guys, your penis will completely disappear in this product. You guys, you guys, this is the final boss of amosexuals. Oh, amosexuals, yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure if that would be the final boss. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I guess. Some people put this shit on and just not... What, what the fuck are they even going to do with this? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Oh my god. Okay, so I want after that grenade. we have we have a rose bottle bong. Okay. Yeah, so you can toke up from the rose wine bottle. Holy just, crap. Not that I know wow. much about this situation, <laughs> but that would be a nasty ass looking bottle before long. Mm -hmm. I didn't yeah. expect this next one. What the yeah, at all. Cool. The next one is <laughs> extra extra finger dildo. No. Let me show you a magic trick. <laughs> Can you imagine a nigga just go full of E.T. on your ass? Like, <laughs> pull my finger. You know the <laughs> where they hit where they hit a thumb or a finger and it just gets super big? Oh That's my god! Looks like. Okay, what else? Okay, so next up we have a heart shaped splash pull, and there's a lady in here with candies, I guess, or ice or something. I don't know. Orbeez or some shit, probably. Fuck. Mm. Yeah, oh, I think those are supposed to be floating flower petals. They should have cho oh. chosen a different color flower, maybe. Yeah, because it's yeah, like flower tissue. petals. It's okay. like a bunch yeah. of toilet tissue. Yeah, right. <laughs> I, thought it was candy. I thought it was candy wrappers or something. <laughs> There's a shitload of used Kleenex. She's just in there. She's probably like, man, this is a, it's a check, it's a paycheck. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's Kleenex moist. <laughs> okay, so if the grenade sex toy wasn't enough for you, you can get an alien sex toy to celebrate all these UFOs we've been having lately. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, they are here. <laughs> <laughs> so it says it's shaped like E.T., but it just looks like generic alien. Yeah, E.T.'s head's not shaped like that. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Bro. Some of the fucking, some of the fucking flavor text. On these items are fucking stupid. <laughs> <laughs> does your does your Valentine find sex toys alienating? <laughs> Get the fuck oh. out of here, dude! Fucking pump fuzz, bro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Those are the best part, though. Yeah. Okay, so next up, we have a fertility applicator, and it comes with three cups where you can go around collecting donations, and then a baster oh. syringe-looking apparatus, so you yeah. can. So you can inject yourself with, with baby batter. You yeah. feel me? You need how romantic? Who is who <laughs> would be giving this gift? Like, well, you know the old poem: first comes love, then comes marriage, <laughs> then comes marry with the fertility applicator. Now, yeah. It doesn't rhyme. That is the flavor text for this item. Mm -hmm. I just. <laughs> oh man. I, I. I wasn't paying attention to any of these. And oh, now I can't oh, stop oh! Them. You guys, this is how Roy's still a virgin. <laughs> Hopefully, it, right, you know yeah, probably. You, yeah. you said it. You yeah, said yeah, it. Yeah, 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 exactly. That's, that's, that's the only way that this would be canon. <laughs> exactly. Except I use a super soaker. You feel me? Ew. <laughs> Of course you would. Okay, so next up we have a pot nugget pillow, and it looks like a baggie full of pot nuggets. Now the only way this would be a great gift is if it also smelled like like the top premium weed. Then it would be a great gift. Mm. Oh. No, thank okay. You. If y'all do that, y'all. I don't want to sleep on nothing that smells like weed. On that mm -hmm. idea. Yes. <laughs> okay. Next up we have Spider Man and Mary Jane sculpture, and this is a. A cute little Spider Man, Mary Jane, sitting on a couch. Mm. Doing I liked it. Mary yeah, Jane got cute. the Spider Man uh, knee socks on. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I didn't yeah that's cute. That. that is cute. Okay. That's cute. But yeah, for the nerds in your life. 
Yeah. This shit um, look just like this shit just looks like a porn parody to me. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> it's because of the list it's on. So after that we have a rose shape. Sh- well, ugh, words. Rose hey, real talk. These right, right here. Hey, these these shits right here is wrong. <laughs> these shits right here. If you started a channel where you just rated sex toys, I bet you have like a million fucking subscribers. <laughs> right? Yeah. Overnight. Good luck being on YouTube, dude. I'm not going to confirm no, or be, deny he, that, yeah, I, that I'm coming into contact with one of these personally. Mm-hmm. Well, what I will say is these motherfuckers is wrong. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Like, if you was ever thinking about getting one, go for it. This nigga's a whole ass sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's not. There have been no checks that we know of. Yeah, I mean, you could have fooled me. The way this nigga just cape for that. Like. Hey, I just saw this shit on the list and was like, hey, they go to, they go to homie right there. What's up? Little man, what's going on? <laughs> how'd, you get, how'd you get on the internet? Okay, so next time we have <laughs> romantic rolling papers. They are romantic. Do you see the one in the middle? It says, shit, bitch, you is fine. <laughs> <laughs> one says, you are so my dope. heart. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Another one says, I love me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, 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 stop. I t- hey, okay, I would just get the ones that say, shit, bitch, you is fine. That is yeah. the funniest <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh Jesus! Okay, next up is Naughty Nudes Coloring Book. So, <laughs> uh, uh, oh boy, a tale of two boobies. Except it's the T, the word that starts with the T. That, that YouTube don't hurt us, please. The title of this shit is Clitoriture. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it says coming alive with color. <laughs> 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 Not clitoriture. <laughs> <laughs> I totally missed that. She was okay. Oh. Yeah. So oh, you God. can you can do that. Um. Next up, we for your coloring book we have offensive crayons. <laughs> so what did he say on them? Oral orange. Oral orange. Pull my hair pink. Nympho na- navy. I think cream. I'm going to cream. Yeah, that's that's kind of fun. <laughs> Bondage rope brown. Uh, accidental anal amarillo. Reach around, Ed. <laughs> Fairly legal lime. Slap <laughs> dance Oops. lavender. That one's <laughs> Rap. <laughs> Debbie does dandelion. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Debbie. Debbie does dandelion. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> No. The okay. biggest, blackest crayon. <laughs> oh, it really does say that. It, it says BBC. <laughs> biggest, blackest crayon. <laughs> you know what? That one should be slightly bigger than all the other crayons. It would be perfect. Yeah. The biggest, blackest crayon. Boy, all right. God. Should we just Someone stop got right here? Should, should, we, should we just stop right here? Are, are we Wait. almost over? I think we're no, almost done. I don't know. No, there's there's like four or five more. Oh, go ahead. Okay. okay, so next up we have cannabis sex lube. It says, "Oh right. hi." Um, oh my god. Yeah, so you can. Yeah, it says Valentine might just might add some THC to your life. Titillating hot copulation. Mm-hmm. That's not that's not the THC I was thinking of. But go ahead. <laughs> right. just imagine, just imagine you fucking, and then you you like five minutes in, and you just get the highest fucking high of your <laughs> life. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Going into all the orifices. Okay, so. Okay. Thing, custom ice Oh, this is topical, though, so it probably won't hit for like four hours. Mm. I mean, you got afterglow time, so that still works out. Um. Then there's, next up, the chocolate sparkling water from Jelly Belly. That sounds gross. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Jelly, Jelly Belly... Is the worst producer of jelly beans uh, in the fucking world. Uh, <laughs> I would rather. Yeah, I, I'll get behind that. Any other jelly bean? Any other Starburst jelly beans? I'll oh, Starburst jelly beans are goaded. 
Bro, mm-hmm. if Hershey's makes jelly beans, I'll eat <laughs> chocolate. <it. laughs> Before I open a jelly belly and accidentally eat a green one. That's or a yellow person, one, like, a yellow one that's <laughs> a yellow one that is not lemon, but actually popcorn. Yeah, popcorn is so gross. One is popcorn flavored jelly, so jelly bean. It's so bad. It didn't have your breast man like burnt popcorn. Yeah. <laughs> you could have done. You could have done pineapple. <laughs> you have to do. You gotta sit yellow. there and suffer through those guys. Apple. Like this is not a good experience. They have regular flavors too, don't they? It's yeah. A, yeah. The yeah you gotta dig around, around for them. Wait, it tastes so like somebody dipped an apple in the toilet and, and <laughs> made How would you dinner. know how to I describe this? <laughs> he, he, he has a lot of experience. It's like somebody ate an apple and shit it out. Okay, let's go to the next okay. one. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Tweaking. Next, tweaking. Up, next up, pre-made gelatin shots. So you don't have to do that one. Bussin. And the mm-hmm. last one is a lip-shaped bath bomb. Is it? Gwyneth Paltrow sent it. I hope not. Those yeah. burned down houses. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> but yeah, so it just looks like it. And it doesn't say what the scent of it is. Yeah, so those are weird gifts you can get for Valentine's Thank, thank you so much for this list. I needed it. <laughs> yes. That I feel like a depressing episode. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. No, it was Debbie does dandelion for me. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I have one. I have one short story, but we'll be, we will be able to get through it super, 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 super fast. But right. we got to talk about it because I feel like next week might be too late. <laughs> okay. Oh, is it re- is it related to? S- I I'll just take the surprise. Yeah. U.S. authorities shot down a fourth unidentified flying object over a North American airspace over the weekend. They haven't commented on whether the object is from China. Uh, oh Su Young has more. U.S. military forces have shot down another unidentified flying object near the Canadian border, hovering over Lake Huron. According to U.S. congressmen who a brief by the Defense Department, the U.S. Air Force and National Guard shot down another aerial object on Sunday, swiftly, safely and securely. Government officials, when questioned by media, would not comment on whether the object resembled the Chinese surveillance balloon that was shot down earlier this month, which the U.S. intelligence community had linked to a program run by China's People's Liberation Army to spy on foreign military assets. This marks the fourth aerial object to be spotted and shot down from North American airspace this month, with the U.S. and Canada on high alert over air incursions. Washington's Federal Aviation Administration closed airspace twice over the weekend and scrambled military jets. Canada also shut down airspace near Ontario on Sunday after an unidentified object was spotted hovering over Yukon Territory. It was shot down by a U.S. F-22 fighter jet. Canadian authorities say the object was cylindrical and smaller than the Chinese balloon discovered off the coast of South Carolina, but was similar in appearance. They say they would not speculate on the origin of the object and stop short of calling it a balloon. Amid allegations of spying on foreign powers, Beijing's foreign ministry claims its balloon shot down near South Carolina was a civilian weather balloon which had veered off course. Both US and Canadian investigators are searching for the remains of the flying objects for a full analysis. Now the footage that they were showing were all were all of just the first weather balloon, not mm-hmm. of the other three that they shot down. Because uh, the third one they said was cylindrical, but the the fourth one they said was an octagon. Oops. It was like weird shaped. I'm sorry, say that again because a, a thing started playing. I think I read that it was octagonal. It wasn't round. Yes. Ball. Yeah, it was oct- it, it was octagonal. So my question is, what are y'all gonna do for the uh, alien invasion? <laughs> I don't know what y'all cooking. Anybody? Oh shoot, everything! <laughs> I'm going out and I'm buying the best meat. <laughs> yeah, the best vegetables. And, and I might throw some boudin on the uh, on the grill. You feel me? Just throw some boudin out there. And it, they said, oh, I've, there's another thing about the oct- octagonal one. There were strings hanging from the bottom of it, as if it airdropped something. 
what if these motherfuckers came down and was like, you know what? They need some like COVID relief and a cure for cancer. And we was like, what's that? Get us now. Shut the shut up. And then, and then they were just like, and that's why we don't pass by Earth. The motherfuckers are too ghetto. <laughs> we wasted our one shot to meet the aliens. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they was like, they need some help down there. Let's airdrop them some help. Some new technology or some shit to solve some problems and cure some diseases. And we're like, that? shoot it out of the sky. <laughs> oh, can I go apocalyptic on this, though? Yes. They dropped some new seeds to reseed the Earth. Mm. And this is how the cordyceps start. <laughs> 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 mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. Get ready. We're all the last of us mm-hmm. now. <laughs> my question is why are we only just now shooting them down? We do we've been having UFO sightings for like a hundred years and they never shot them down. Why in 2023 they decided they want to start shooting them down? Because That's... we've already we've already gone through like a pandemic, which was pretty wild. So they don't really have a whole lot of exciting weird stuff to do now mm. we've all gone through the mind depression of illness and sickness yeah. everywhere well do y'all think there'll be a couple more in the next two weeks is that that's four in the last eight days probably <laughs> i can't imagine it just know, dropping it off the face we'll, of the we'll see we'll mm. see what's going on but and also what I'm, why- what I'm confused about is is like what are they shooting these down with? Missiles or something? What the fuck are they shooting these down with? One was a missile. They said on, uh, well, take it with a grain of salt because the news tells us what they want us to believe. So. How much does a missile cost? <laughs> are we spending a million dollars a pop to sh- shoot these shits down? Or what, what's going on? Yeah, that's a Probably. good question. I want to know how much it's costing the, the American public. Are they going to come back and say, well, we need to give $8 billion to the Space Force now? Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. And why would they only come to America? That doesn't even make sense. If it was a real alien invasion, it would be global. Because we're, f- we're, we're, we're where all the weirdos are right now. They're mm-hmm. all like, hmm, what's the most ratchet? Per capita. <laughs> per capita <laughs> ratchetness. If we can take them out, then the others are a piece of cake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We ready to wrap up, y'all? Yeah. Your boy got his restaurant. Joe fell, or not Joe, Jay fell. You too? <laughs> <laughs> I just Holy have to talk fucking about shit. I couldn't let, let that pass a week. <laughs> well, yeah, well, thanks for joining us, sir. Uh, let's go ahead and get out of here. Chris, thanks for joining us. <laughs> Lady Shots, thanks for joining us. Thanks, everybody, for watching, listening, like, subscribe, and let everybody know about the Most Hood Podcast on YouTube and let us know what you think about Last of Us. My name is Jay. Have a nice day. Hey, hey, hey.